And just to wrap things up, about the AI age that is called AI age, about agents, uh, what is the thing that you think most people don't realize and they should? Because the models have been getting so, so uh, have been getting better so quickly, I don't think people realize how ready they are for day-to-day -day activities. One of my predictions is that almost at least every developer, if not every human being, is going to have a little personal AI assistant that they use and talk to by the end of the year. I, one of the other pitches I make is that developers, for the last 10 years, people have been making a website as their side project on weekends. By the end of the year, everyone is going to be making little personal AI assistants by the end of, uh, for themselves. And it's because technology goes through a paradigm shift where it starts off as being expensive and the purview of uh, subject matter experts and billion dollar companies, and they get commodified to the point that hackers, enthusiasts, tinkerers like me can write it in a few lines of code. And I think we are almost there. You should use the AI agents SDK to do that. Uh, but I suspect it's going to be so much more widespread and mainstream by the end of the year, simply because the models have gotten good and the infrastructure app layer is like so fun to hack on right now. Would you like to be a young person doing a code and starting things right now? Oh yeah, amazing. It's In fact, uh, I was taught how to use AI code editors by the interns at Cloudflare. Shout out to Dravya. He sat me down and he's like, this is what Cursor is. And I was blown away. Uh, the younger people have such a leg up. They get to, especially because they're born into the style of coding and the capabilities that are there. Uh, I can't imagine how wonderful it must be to be able to play in this space at the moment.